All right, thanks, Alyssa. Happening today, a lone finalist is named for the Amarillo Independent School District Superintendent position. Longtime educator Dr. Dana West was announced by the school board as the choice this afternoon. ABC 7 Stephen Graves is live in the studio with how this decision for the position is making history. Stephen? Lisa Larry West would be the first woman in the 126 year history of AISD to take the position. Her colleagues say this, the decision was an easy one to make with her impressive re resume of educational experience. Consequently, in a crowded room filled with applause, Amarillo ISD's newest leader was welcomed with open arms. Members of the school board and other AISD dignitaries gathered to name Dr. Dana West as lone finalist. Uh, we looked for someone that was going to just step in and, and take us to the next level. West brings 25 years of educational experience. She's not only served as the principal of two schools under AISD, but also held high-ranking positions in other districts, bringing valuable experience to her new position. There's lots of great things going on in our district, and I just, I just want to continue to build on those. And the way that I'll do that is by hearing what, what ideas are in our community. Amarillo ISD would welcome West with much success, but also a time where specific challenges are facing the district, like student poverty and a high number of refugee families. So Dr. West is going to have to deal with not only our, our, our gifted and talented students, not only our, our uh, special education children, but also these children who, who deal with uh, uh, poverty and, and come from an economically disadvantaged background. Dr. West will replace 43-year AISD leader Rod Schroeder, who's leaving the superintendent position after 15 years. West says Schroeder is a mentor to her, ultimately using his practices as inspiration for the job. He listens. He pays attention to the community and asks questions and 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 he has a big heart for our kids and that's that's important to me as well. Now West currently works as Caprock Cluster a director. She was chosen after numerous internal interviews and once West is officially voted on as superintendent, she'll start at the beginning of the next school year. Reporting from the Candy Broadcast Center, Stephen Graves, ABC 7 News.